Hey everybody, my name's Silver. Welcome back for more Bungo Stray Dogs Tales of the Lost here on the channel. It's I, I I need to stop saying this damn near every single time we start a Bungo video, but it's been a minute since we last played Bungo Stray Dogs here on the channel. There's a whole bunch of updates. If you guys did not actually check out the community tab, then you guys would not know. But I will go ahead and go into more of that when we actually do go ahead and start the video. But before we do begin, if you guys are hyped and ready for the return of Bungo Straight Out to the Lost here in the channel, definitely make sure to hit that like button for your boys. Well, consider subscribing to the channel for more anime game related content as well as more Bungo Straight Out to the Lost here in the channel. Without further ado, let us begin. Oh my goodness. First things first, again, I'm sorry. We have a lot of stuff that's actually been happening and I have to show you guys a lot of it, I guess you can say. Now, the easiest way to show you guys is just by going through this menu and going through the notices right here. You guys can probably tell that we are getting pretty close to Halloween. Today for me recording is the 27th Halloween. I'm pretty sure it's on the 31st. So I do have a couple of days left, but from the time that I haven't played the game, but I have been doing my login bonuses and whatnot, to the time that I have, which is, I guess you can say, today, a whole bunch of stuff has happened. Whether it has been the limiteds for the Oda Sasunosuke, shout out to the summer vacation. They literally have every single Oda on a banner, at least the three SSRs that we just, just go ahead and go over. We have the Halloween banners right here, another Halloween step up banner, the actual Halloween event, which we will go ahead and go on and take on another black market plus event so shout out to that and probably won't be able to grind it up that much because of the fact that i still have not done any of these type of, of i guess you can say summon video so there goes that but we did have a whole bunch of stuff for rompa we have some stuff for ongo for his birthday more step up banners and then the costume party which is what we are going to be doing today so this costume party event is one like or none like any other i guess i should say for the fact well, well let me go ahead and read it for you guys it says thank you for playing blingo straight diets to the lost halloween characters missing person event revival limited edition nakahiro chinya and kaji morijiro will be featured once again in the missing persons event now mind you guys this event period leaves on the 31st today for me is the 27th so it has been exactly 10 days since this event came out and i have not touched it at all pretty sad i know but that's why we are here today the rewards are right there as well as well as the details the search event is available for specific stages defeat the enemies within the stages for a chance to receive the event only character the drop rates will be higher for the stages on higher difficulty levels so for example the stages that we have to do are the riverbank the back alley and the crime scene now that means that we can possibly get one of these two characters right there as well as their stats and everything below it but we basically have to go to the quest hit the battle find exactly where we have to go luckily it tells us which one is that because it says the chance right there for example we go to the riverbank and then we literally have to take on the highest one which luckily for me i've already done my grinding for those things so i can go ahead and get more abilities crystals or ability stones that i could go ahead and do some summons so i do have the very hard for basically all of these things unlocked so that's kind of what we have to do but before we do get into all of that i want to go ahead and do my daily summon now again all of these banners are here whether it be step up banners every single type of banner the scene card banners and the normal scout banner right here but i was able to actually go ahead and i thought i actually had an ssr ticket maybe i didn't pick it up yet well let me go ahead and do all of this stuff first and my goodness it's been an absolute minute yeah i should have an ssr ticket ready which i will probably go and do this reply all let me do the the you right there give me my friend points back out of it real quick these right here hit that back out real easy here we go oh my goodness i want all of this where is it at the one ssr scout ticket that is exactly what i need because we will be doing a summon today oh my goodness it's been a minute since i've seen this summit screen we're gonna go ahead and use our ssr scout ticket so that hopefully we can get a brand new ssr or hopefully one that we do not already have maxed out but either way hopefully that was enough time for you guys to go and grab your tickets to your stones for whatever banner for, for whatever game and now y'all know the rules it's three two one tap and with that you guys get to pull down a swipe back 
I don't really know what you guys have to do because I'm not sitting there right next to you guys summoning. But either way, though, I give you guys my best wishes, my best of luck. Hopefully, you guys will be able to pull something good. If you guys did or didn't, let me know in the comment section below. But without further ado, let's get started. Three, two, one, tap. Again, Purple Moon. The real question is, who is it going to be? How lucky can we get today? It was a Kyoka dupe. Now, I'm not mad because it is a dupe, you know, but uh, uh, hi, how you doing? Let me go ahead and just do this right now and then we can go and actually hop into the event, which we still have not done yet. So where are you at actually, Kyoka? Um, I know that's not my first one of you, what? Oh, she's the one that can be. Ah, I like that. So I don't have to reverse them back down. I really do like that. Shout out to that. I will definitely take it. All right, here we go. I'm gonna go to battle. I actually wanna start at the river bank and just do the very hard one. I don't think we have to take any sort of member. Or any type of step up because I'm pretty sure that's just not how it works. But where's my team one at? No, this is not the right team. It is this team right here. Let's see if we can actually go ahead and grab one of the newer units. Also, you guys can probably tell that I still have my headphones in. If you guys did not watch the Dragon Ball Legends video where we did go ahead actually go ahead and take on the Kid Boo event, because I do know that some of you guys wanted to see it, some of you guys probably did not. But either way, I did go ahead and mention that your boy found a way to be able to actually go ahead and hear the sound because normally when I play the game, I wouldn't be able to hear the sound and it was absolutely kind of garbage for your boy because I was sitting here basically talking with no type of music or anything in the background. But I literally just hooked it up to my little computer right here where luckily everything is recording so this is not any type of failed attempts or anything like that. But I can now hear the game sound right on par. So absolutely amazing i want you guys to know if i did I don't, I don't i don't know why it took me this long just to realize i can literally just plug in my headphones in and then everything would work but i want to murder you guys really quick so i'm gonna do that i'm going to do this and i still have no idea what that shibu asawa's i guess you can say ability is so to one enemy oh that's kind of weak but the marble force is pretty good so Oh, that's crazy. Oh my goodness. If I don't get a beat down with this, I'm actually going to be really mad. Or an all clear is, I guess, what I should call it. Whoopsies. Might be. You know, it's been a minute, but, you know, that's definitely never an excuse. Shout out to that. And the boss battle. Is it actually going to be a Halloween character? I guess not. I missed it. How did I miss it? Oh my goodness. How did I miss that? Well, I mean, you're dead anyways, but... My question now is, am I actually able to get the Halloween character? I did! I got them both! Huh. Well, since we're here, let's go ahead and take a look at their entire thing. So, again, Kaiji Monotodori. Mor I, I don't freaking know his last name, but he's the Lemon Bomber dude. Y'all know him. Y'all probably love him. If you don't, welcome, because I definitely do not either. I'm going to go ahead and lock him up. He's from Port Mafia, but Motojiru Kanji, dressed as a famous monster brought back from death, gives out handmade candy even though nobody wants it. He's supposed to be Frankenstein, but it kind of sucks because nobody wants his candy, but then again, that is the life that you got to live. So his leader skill, this costume is perfect, reduces damage from Venom by 40% in this active skill, which if it'll scroll through again, I'll give you this. Is that, is that, is that just it? Yeah, no, I'll give you this pretty one. Okay. Either way, that changes all dark infinity orbs to emeralds. Ah, he's an orb changer. Okay. His sub skill one activates every turn when team HP is at 100%. For one turn, one HP will remain even if dealt the killing blow. That is really nice. That is really nice. I really do like that. Let's check out the Chuya. 
Oh, I was about to say, it seemed like my game kind of just died on me for a second. I was really confused. But the Nakahiro Chuya, the costume party won again from Port Mafia. Nakahiro Chuya was forced to wear a werewolf costume to this party. He was not pleased to give up his hat for the costume and finds the ears odd and uncomfortable, which is why he's, you know. Leader skill, what else do you get to put? On a costume. Oh, okay. Increases H or increases the team HP by 20%. In his active skill, Howling of the Wolf, I'm guessing, which is going to be the entire thing, hopefully. Howling of the Wolves might be. Reduces the attack of all enemies by 10% for one turn. His sub skill 1 activates when 70. Total light orbs are clear. Completely fills the beatdown gauge. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I'd rather have the Kanji than the Chuya, which is absolutely wild because I like Chuya more as a character than, than the Kanji over there, but what can you do? I want to see how many we can get, because if that was just doing the the regular riverbank, you know, the very first one, if we decide to do the crime scene, which is supposed to be the last one, do the boss battle for very hard, I actually have to sell some of these. Oh my goodness. I would have never guessed that I actually hit my limit. Well, no, I don't think I actually hit my limit. I think what it's talking about is for my materials, right? Is it this? Is it character power up? I think it might be. For now, since I do have these two, I might as well go ahead and use them. Oh, yeah, all of my stuff is. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, uh... Give me a sec. I'm going to go ahead and then just cut and uh, we'll be right back the moment we do go and hop into this thing. All right. So we're back here at the crime scenes. I literally just used a whole bunch of materials to either get both of those new SR units that we did just get up to level 60. Went and got those to SR pluses, but I didn't max them out. But what I ended up doing afterwards was literally just using, I guess you can say, a little bit more to go ahead and grab up some of my... What are they called? The scene cards. I just went and I guess you can say level those up as well. So now I just got to have to evolve them on my own time. But either way, though, we are back here again at the crime scene scenario. I'm going to go ahead and take on the boss battle for the very hard. And because we don't really need a specific unit to take, I kind of want to see if I can find that specific octagon. No, a sushi. Yeah, something's definitely wrong with me. If that's not the case, then can I get the green dodge light, please? You're level 27, though. Ah. What about the... No, he's not here either. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Who am I going to take as a leader? I don't want Bantuya. I have used Bantuya before, but still. What about... Here we go. I will definitely take this. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What can we do now? I at least, the only reason why I do want to see if, uh, well, let me pop you first just to see if we'll kill. That's fine. That's totally fine. Because if that's just the case, then all I got to do is this, and then both of them are wiped out and we're good to go. We didn't have to waste an ability, basically, is what I was trying to go for. But the one thing that I really am curious about and why I'm actually going to go ahead and take on this crime scene one right now is just for the fact if it's like, would we be able to get more than one Chia or Kaji or Kanji, whatever the heck his name may be, the lemon bomb dude, you know, are we going to get more than one of those if we do go ahead and take on a higher event, you know? Hopefully you guys understand what I'm trying to say. If not, then we're literally going to go ahead and find out in like a minute or so. <laughs> After we go ahead and demolish everybody with beatdown. That is not what I meant by demolish. Not at all. Okay. I don't know if I should be mad at that. And I don't know if I should be happy either. <laughs> I'm really confused. Oh, no. I'm definitely mad about that one. Oh, my goodness. You hate to see it. You absolutely hate to see it. I mean, I got the sling strike, so I did go ahead and get the kill. I kind of want to pop your ability real quick, just so we can get the marble force. Dopogintaku! <laughs> you love to see it, bro. Can I get the beatdown? Thank you, the all clear. I gotta say that right, man. Can I get the sync strike? The beat? No, not the beat. Ah, oh, I'm messing up already. I love this game, bro. I really do.
I was so confused for a second because I stopped hearing the sound and I had to check my what's called over here, but everything's still good. But it's basically telling me to hurry the fuck up. <laughs> so that was a waste of a beatdown. I just realized that. Oh my goodness, your boy's slipping. No, yeah, you hate to see it. You really hate to see it, man. We got a boss battle. How you doing, sir? It's been an absolute good minute since we actually have taken on any type of story and seen your face as well. Shout out to you being in locked in prison. Well, I really don't think that's a really good shout out, but. So, wildly enough, my game actually did stop recording like I said it was now. <laughs> Because of that, I actually did go ahead and just scroll through it, and I guess you can say run through the rest of it, go ahead and just beat the rest of it, and then I actually did go ahead and take a screenshot of when we actually did go ahead and beat it. So you guys probably saw the very first screenshot up on the screen, probably on that side right there where the game should actually go ahead and be. You guys were able to see what type of characters we were able to get, and... The way I came into this event was basically thinking, depending on which one we do, you know, maybe the river bank will give us both of the units at the same time. One of them will give me one set of units, the other one will give me another set, and that's kind of why I wanted to go ahead and take on at least all three of them in today's video, but that was not the case since I am now out of space, so I'm going to have to go ahead and do that stuff on my own time, but right now, I at least wanted to show you guys the three screenshots that I do have. One of the first one, I guess you can say the first ending of it, or at least not really the three, but the two. But the next time that I actually did go ahead and take on, I think it was the crime scene. I actually have to do back out of it because of the fact that <laughs> I literally just got done with me going through it the second time. No, the one with the back alley, we actually did go ahead and take it on twice. One time we actually did go ahead and end up getting both the, what is it? Both of the Chuyas and the Naka... I don't I don't know his name, bro. The kanji dude, you know the lemon bomber dude. We were able to we were able to get actually both of them, but then I took it on a second time, which is a screenshot that you guys should see right now. And I just got two kanjis. So there is no oh hey, you can take on this event and then you'll probably get more from doing this one right there, which I thought was gonna happen in my head, but that was obviously just not the case. So I guess with that being done, I'm going to go ahead and end off this video right here. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you did enjoy it, do not forget to hit that like button for your boys. Well, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more anime gaming related content. I do understand that this video was kind of short, but I at least wanted to go ahead and pump it out the way for you guys before, I guess you can say, Halloween ended up did coming. Now off screen, I am going to go ahead and grind up the rest of those units. And then we can hopefully go ahead and show those units off on their own little respective team. And then just, I guess you can say, call it a day at that. Again, I'm sorry that all of this just ended up happening. I really did not expect that at all, but we got to make do, okay? Welcome back, I guess you can say, is what it's telling me. But either way, though, I'm a dip. Have a good day. Have a good night, wherever you are, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye. your butt off.